what is up guys welcome to cyberspace and today is just going to be a short video we're going to be talking about um the rumors that apple is not going to be putting uh those wired airpods and a in a adapter in the iphone 12. now this has rightly started controversy among the tech enthusiasts in the world and many have suggested that it's a moved move to reduce e-waste now um personally i call bs on that because um there was a there was a petition from the eu um to have apple convert all their iphones into usb-c cables the conversion to usb-c would be a universal charging port and thus would induce reduce e-waste for products around the world now what i think is for this is is for is for apple to um make better profits basically and my theory on that is that many of the rumors for the iphone 12 would be that it would be 649 instead of 699 now if you simply go on apple's websites the the adapter plus the headphones is 50 dollars and that's the price from 699 to 649 um and i think this might be a good move for someone who already has like an iphone 11 and is trying to upgrade to the iphone 12 you already have the adapter you probably already have you own your ear pods your a bluetooth headphones because you've been dealing without the without the old headphone jack and all that so so I can understand the move kind of, but for someone who uses Android phones like me, it would make me not want to come to the iPhone ecosystem because I would have to go pay for my adapter and I have to go buy the Bluetooth headphones or the wired earpods and I'd have to buy an adapter to put my wired headphones in. So it would kind of be a bother. And also a point with the new customers, for example, a Karen or something, they might buy an iPhone 12 for their son and then open that up and realize it doesn't have the required stuff to charge it properly and uh, they can't even listen to music on it um, without using the built-in speakers. Um, and, the, and the customer will have to make another trip to the store to buy those accessories needed to fully enjoy the experience. So when you're buying the iPhone 12, you're not getting that full experience straight out of the box which is which phones that are do that cause way less are doing correctly but i hope that they do not do this on the pro models because for a thousand dollars you should definitely be getting all the required accessories to fully enjoy the phone hello this is future me and i just wanted to add one more point to the iphone 12 not be able to add accessories in the box so you know many stores like cvs walgreens you know your kroger's they have these cheap um adapters for your phones and of course you don't want um, a person who just bought their thousand dollar iphone will spend one dollar on this accessory and what do you know your phone is blown up and of course apple will probably not cover it because it wasn't an apple accessory that was approved and that will probably cause a lot of trouble for people for the company because they might get lawsuits um because the adapter wasn't included in the box but in all um if you're an existing apple customer it shouldn't really affect you. but if you are a new person to coming to apple you probably won't enjoy this too much and that's all i got to say about it uh if you like this video please stay at that subscribe button uh, thumbs up the video and subscribe to the channel. I think you could be in the first 20 subscribers. So yeah, it might be worth something someday. So thank you very much. I hope you have a good one.